What's up guys? My oh my fuck. My name's Anthony and welcome back to Brutal Doom. This time with an upgrade. Not only do I have like five fucking marines following me and they'll never shut the hell up. But uh I got a uh, new mod. This is actually the Project Brutality Doom mod. And uh, rather than the older Brutal Doom mod that I was just running off, Project Brutality is like way more than Brutal Doom was. Also, I got another mod that is uh, called Maps of Chaos or something like that. It adds a shitload of depth to all of the maps. Just adds so much more to them. So, uh, yeah, they'll have a lot more secrets, they'll be a lot bigger, and let's go! Alright, he was- he got fucked. Anyway... Oh god. Oh god. Anyway, I've been having a pretty shitty time lately. So, uh, I'm probably just gonna bitch and moan this entire video. So, if you don't know, I, I actually got a job in the past, uh, like two months ago. I got a job working at And, uh, I, okay, I'm gonna censor that. I don't want you guys to know exactly where I work. Anyway, I go by fuck. I got a job working at a hardware store, and if, uh, working retail has taught me one thing, it's that people are absolute fucking dumbasses. Ooh, hey, secrets. Press R to alternate thing. Oh yeah, this has this mod has so much shit to it. Oh shot! You see this? I can load buckshot or shotgun slug. Like every gun has multiple ways to shoot it, and fucking dual wielding magnums, dude. That's awesome. You need a sawed off shotgun? Oh my god! I can dual wield a chainsaw and sawed off shotgun. What? I. Laser activated. Shut the fuck up, all of you! Okay, dual wielding plasma rifles. Things. Yeah, let's go. I can't see shit. Die, forces of evil! I think I got him. <laughs> anyway, yeah, people are complete fucking dumbasses. They don't know shit. Like, most of them are fucking idiots. What the hell is my guy yelling? Shut up, all of you! Oh my god, hold up. Hold up. I need... I need to do some shit. Sound options. First of all, music. Crank that shit up. And, uh, everything else, shut the hell up. Alright. Listen to some nice, classical music. Fuck, I didn't mean to get that. Hello, Pinky! Die, bitch! Oh, go oh, fuck. Fuck me, they're all behind me. Uh, so, as many of you may have known, uh, I got a motorcycle recently. I say many of you, the video got like 14 views. Anyway, I got a motorcycle recently, and holy shit is that thing awesome. Like, seriously, I put- oh, fuck. I've had it for about a little over a month now, maybe? I've put around 700 miles on it. Oh my god, is that thing so fucking fun. But, you know what? After I got a motorcycle, I realized, like, a lot of what I do in daily life, like, ever since I got a job and a motorcycle, so I have my own mode of transportation. Ever since then, I haven't been playing video games or doing any of the shit I used to do nearly as often. Like, I used to- oh my god. Always have 70 hours or around that 50 to 70 hours in the past two weeks uh, Played on Steam now if I look at it, I'll probably have like fucking zero Cuz I just haven't been playing that much. Oh my god. I Almost died cuz I just haven't Bothered playing that much whenever I had free time like I get the weekend off or something I go out and just <laughs> I go out and just, uh, ride around or whatever, take a trip somewhere, and- uh, uh, Too many, too many, no health, too many people. Die, Pinky! Oh god, it's still alive, what the fuck? Die, everything, just fuck off, please. Anyway, yeah, 
So I've never played this level before and I have no idea what the hell I'm doing. So, you know, that's a good start and holy hell I need V-Sync turned on. I'll do that in the next part. Where the fuck am I going? Hello! <laughs> oh my god, I just chopped his fucking head off with a, like, hatchet or something. Alright. Anyway, I've been riding the motorcycle around mainly. That's all I've been doing for fun, really. In... As of late. And I don't know what the hell this thing is in my inventory. That thing right down there. It looks like some kind of robotic dildo or some shit. I have no idea what the hell that is. I have no idea where the hell I'm supposed to go. Where am I supposed to go? Alright, maybe I was supposed to go down here from the beginning instead of that way. Hello! Die! Everything! Oh, this! This! Fuck this game just for this. Fuck this mod just for this. As fucking shield dudes, and they're goddamn assholes, because you can never fucking kill them. Fuck off. Oh, fuck. Oh, my fuck. Oh, my God. So many pinkies. What is with all these pinkies? Just die already. God. Fuck off. Oh, Jesus. It's still alive. Why did I get that? Why did I get that? Why am I picking up everything I don't need? Magnum! What else can I pick up that I don't need? Ooh, more armor. What have we here? A whole, a whole load of shit that I don't want to deal with right now. Fuck off. Fuck off. Alright. Anyway, I was going to talk more about uh, my motorcycle and shit, so I was replacing the bar ends just earlier today, and oh my god, the fucking Incredible Hulk or some shit put those on. Like, bar ends, by the way, are the uh, little knobby shit at the uh, ends of your- Don't you fucking dare shoot at me, okay? Are the little knobby shit that's at the end of your uh, handlebars. And, uh, I kinda dropped my bike the second day I had it. It had like 14 miles on it. Fuck! Yeah, so, um, anyway, I, I bought some new bar ends to replace on there, and, uh, cause the ones I had were kinda a little bit scratched up, and I was like, yeah, I want some nice ones. I, I ordered these ones off eBay, they say Ninja on them, cause I have the Kawasaki Ninja 300. And, uh, I thought it looked pretty spiffy, pretty cool. Um, holy fucking hell was it hard to replace them. Like I said, the goddamn Incredible Hulk put those fucking things on. Because I could straight up not get them off. I don't know what was up. I had a goddamn drill. I couldn't get that shit off. It was put on there so fucking tight. Well, hey there. Hey, I got another guy. So, yeah, I took it... Uh, over to the hardware store I look at, had my boss look at, he, he managed to get, uh, one of them loose, and, uh, I managed to get it off when I got home, but holy fucking hell, I got this shit, so I got a, uh, I got a half inch to three eighths inch adapters for socket wrenches, and then the three eighths to quarter inch, so I could use it with a fucking screwdriver bit, and even with that, I had such a fucking hard time getting it off. I completely s stripped the bolt. I had to take a goddamn hacksaw to the thing, pliers, I, people recommended heating it up to do it, to take it off too, so I was like using fucking lighters and shit, heating it up. Well, hello there. And oh my fucking god, it literally took me two goddamn hours to get the thing off. I'll put in a picture of what of what the one side looks like compared to the other one. I mean, they look basically the same before I did all that shit to them. And oh my god, it was just such a pain in the ass. It took so fucking long. I was sweating my ass off. Ugh. And then uh, I went off riding uh, the other weekend I had 
which I have Thursday and Friday off, so I don't have the weekends off, but, uh, that's Thursday and Friday are my weekends. Oh, fuck, I just told this guy to stay or something. Here, yeah, follow me. Follow me, asshole. Follow. Follow. I have accomplished nothing so far. Where the- Oh, I have the blue key. I didn't even notice. Anyway, so, uh, hey, what's up with this? Nothing? Alright. Uh, the fucking Pinky from hell. Er, well, they're all from hell. Pinky from more hell. Double hell. Over here. Holy shit, I love- Oh my god, that obliterated him! He blew up into little tiny pieces. I've been using way too much ammo for that. Why, well, hello there, yellow key. I'm gonna check out this area some more. So, I met this one guy at the MSF course. He was a pretty cool dude. His name is Chris. He's really into computers and shit. And, uh, you know, so am I. He didn't have a ride or anything or a car of his own, so, uh, neither did I. So, we hung out for most of the course. Uh, we had to each hitch a ride with the actual instructor of the course. So, um, yeah, that was fun. That course was so fucking, oh my god, we were out in a parking lot for the most part. Oh my god, was that hard. By the way, the MSF course is the, uh, motorcycle, holy fuck! Is, uh, stands for motorcycle safety course. Oh, fuck. <laughs> or motorcycle safety foundation course. Fuck, 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 fuck. No one cares about foundation, they, no. <laughs> Anyway, so, uh, me and him finally got our bikes, and we went, uh, riding around this past, uh, week. And we rode for, like, the hell are you doing down there? Get up here, you dick! Oh, I probably told them to wait. I'll get him later. So, uh, I'll just go ahead and get him now. So, uh, yeah, he got a Yamaha R3, and I got a Kawasaki Ninja 300. I don't know where the fuck I'm going. So, these are like the top two beginner bikes, like the top two competing brands, or whatever the hell you'd like to call them. And I gotta say, we rode each other's bikes, his is so much fucking lighter than mine. Like, just sitting on it, it is noticeably lighter than my bike. What the fuck? Where am I? Switching to shotgun slugs. Okay. Oh, shit! Fuck this, man. Chain gun! Screw you all! So, yeah, uh, we went riding around. I got there at, like, 2.30. We didn't stop until, like, 10 o'clock. Granted, we went a whole bunch of places. Some gas stations, fries. Went around this, uh, one area where weren't too many people, so we could... We kind of raced each other around. His bike is definitely faster than mine. So, like, from just starting off from a dead stop, he has, like, way more get up and go on his bike. Don't get me wrong. I still love my bike. I, his bike is better. Although, it doesn't have ABS, so I, while I was riding his bike, I was, like, so fucking careful with his brakes. Because I didn't want to, like, lock him up or anything. Uh, with mine, you could just fucking stomp on him hard as you want. You'd be okay. I mean, you probably shouldn't because you'd be a fucking moron to do that. Even with ABS, you'd still probably fall on your ass. But, uh, yeah, I had a lot of fun. Went around a shitload. Lost my fucking camera. If you saw my previous motorcycle video, uh, I don't know where the hell I'm going. If you saw my previous motorcycle video, I had a camera mounted to the side of my helmet. That fell off near his house. Oh, fuck. I have no idea where it was. We went looking for so long and could not find my fucking camera. We went- and I- I lost it at night, by the way. It was like, uh, that Thursday night. Couldn't fucking find it. Saturday- or not Saturday. Friday morning we were looking around. Still couldn't fucking find it, so all hope is lost. Fuck it, it's in- it's in camera heaven right now. That- that fucking thing probably got obliterated on the road. Cause the road was like, 45 minimum. We may have been slightly exceeding the speed limit. Uh, so... Yeah, it probably got fucking obliterated once it hit the ground, which... 
Oh my god, I I am so upset by it. it may not sound like it, but I am so fucking upset by that. Cause I paid like a hundred and fifty no, a hundred and sixty dollars for that camera. It came with a uh little remote that you put on your wrist. And I'm gonna go back and get these guys like I forgot to do. Fucking follow me, assholes. So yeah, the camera with the live view remote retails for like $280 or something. It's If you're interested, it's the Sony AS100. And oh my god. Oh, I'm so fucking... I'm so... I'm, I'm not gonna get over it. I'm so fucking upset that I lost that goddamn camera. And where the hell did I go? I'm just running around like an asshole. Here we go. Here's... Where, fuck. Here. No. Wait. No. Fuck. Where the fuck is that one red door? I passed it like 80 times coming in here. Here we are. Hello. Reload, please. Anyway. Uh, okay, I opened that up. Oh, there we go. Now you give me a path. Hey, that's the end of this one. So, uh, yeah, in conclusion, I lost my fucking camera, hung out with a pretty cool dude who was a lot of fun, uh, did a whole bunch of shit, rode around, put like a hundred miles on my bike just riding with him. But, uh, yeah. I am so fucking upset I lost that goddamn camera. Oh god, the floor looks so wonky. Uh, next episode, probably gonna bitch and moan some more, so look forward to that. Anyways, I thought I'd record a gameplay video. I probably would have recorded another, uh, I probably would have recorded me fucking riding around with him and doing some shit because we had such adventures. Oh my god, so many dumbasses on the road. We were at fucking Chipotle. I went there for the first time in my life, eating a burrito there, standing in front of the window. There were so many dumbasses in the parking lot, just like straight up parking and like, parking in the middle of the driveway and halting traffic for everyone and all this stupid shit. People don't know how to park where the shit. A lot of cool encounters with other motorcyclists and, yeah, it was a fun time. So, uh, anyways, I'm probably gonna get another one of those cameras, but until then, thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, then give it a thumbs up and I will see you guys in the next one. Oh, look, they're all staring at me. Alright. Quit looking at me, you weirdo. Okay.